kind of hot out here. I thought it would have cooled down from it. What? The wind is blowing though, but. It's after six. So I'm going to go for this little walk here. And we'll see how I go, y'all. I want to speak two songs, not too busy. Got my water. You gotta stay hydrated. Always put a couple of bottles of water in the freezer. Like when I'm going out, I have like a little small cooler. You can put like six bottles of water. And I put maybe one with ice that's frozen solid. Keeps all the other ones good and cold. Today I had some shrimp fried rice. I got it from Walmart. It was pretty good. And that's what I ate for dinner. What did I have this morning? I think I had two boiled eggs. I didn't have lunch. Just been trying to drink. I got power eight. You know what that watermelon juice? I've been buying the watermelons and doing the fresh watermelon juice. It really fills you up. It does really fill you up. I bought this proactive, nutritious shake. It has 30 grams of protein. I'll show a picture. And I know um, Kick It With Lynn, she was talking about um, asking me how it tastes. Tastes pretty good. And at my uh, appointment, nutritionist, they had coupons. That's how I knew about the uh, shake. I said, hmm. I said, I think I'm going to try that. And I got, a, I got a bunch of coupons. They had a stack of them, so I got a lot of them. Just in case I liked it, and I do. You know how you get some protein shakes that have like a, any kind of shake. You know how they have like an aftertaste? Didn't have an aftertaste for me. My legs are still moving. I just want to drink some water. That's a medicine that mm. good. One of the new medicines that I start taking kind of have your mouth dry. But some may call that like, cotton mouth. Real, real dry, so. Try to keep water. Something to drink. Plus, I got, I need to be drinking more water anyway. And you know, watermelon juice. Actually, is a very good source for hydration. No, I'm not a doctor. You can do your own research. Anything, even from like your doctors, anything medical wise, 
you know, not saying that they don't know anything. They don't know everything. They only go by, the, listen, the doctors only go by what we tell them, how we feel. We know our own body. So they go by what we tell them, and then they do, like, different um, tests according to what we tell them. They got to run tests. So, you know your own body. But, two, do your own research on certain things. Just because somebody else is doing something, and you may want to try it, which is good, but before you try it, do your own research, consult your doctor, you know? Then you gotta realize too, some people are allergic to certain things. And another thing, certain medicines that you take, other things may interact, so you wanna be safe. You want to be safe. See, the Lord, God give man knowledge. To the doctor's knowledge. Also gives us knowledge. So, you know, you have to be careful. Do your own research. And go from there. This is not my first walk today. I just wanted to help my food to digest. So that's why. Hey, how you doing? Good to see you. What you got in that plate? Okay. Awesome, awesome. Well, guess what? You got dinner. Uh-huh. That's my neighbor. Nice young man. Whew. Very nice. Okay. I'm gonna take me another take me another swig, y'all. Uh, whew. That was good. Real good. Here, got a little nice little area to sit down. All right, try to make sure ain't no bugs over here. All right, let old four say sit here and take a load off. This is gonna be about the end of my video. Just giving y'all a little update. That's all.